Come on, Dr. Meyer, here's the toucan. Jason, I didn't say toucan, I said you can. Oh. Hi, and I'm Howard with Airlane. Today in the You Can, Too Can video series, we're going to discuss methods of controlling bleeding. As in the opening video, when you're presented with a vessel that is leaking, the first step is to apply direct pressure. Next, we're going to apply some dressings. And remember, never take off that initial dressing. Next, we'll secure the dressing in place. And if this method does not control the bleeding, the next step would be to place a tourniquet, a blood pressure cuff, or some other form of a constricting band above the injury site. So you place the blood pressure cuff, make sure it's properly secured, and then we're going to air it up to systolic blood pressure, and then 20 millimeters of mercury greater than that, or until the bleeding stops. Hey, Howard, did you know that the use of tourniquets date as far back as to the Roman Wars? No, I didn't. So after this is done, we're going to make sure we document the exact time and where we place this tourniquet. And we also want to keep an eye on pressure cuffs throughout our transport. You might need to add a little bit more air. Thank you for watching this series of the You Can't Do Game production.